Hi, I'm Mel, part of the product development team at Evo. One of the fundamental aspects we face as colourists is white hair coverage. At Evo, we break it into three main areas. Blending, contemporary and opaque coverage. Blending is ideal when you have a small amount of white hair and your client is looking for a natural result. Contemporary coverage is perfect for fine to medium hair types when you're wanting a multi-dimensional natural coverage. Opaque coverage is best suited to those who are wanting maximum density in their coverage. Both Huverse Permanent and Demi Permanent Gloss Ranges host a full spectrum of natural shades which is specifically designed to give you the best results when covering white hair. Huverse Permanent Standard Naturals are cool and work well when mixed with a cool tonal shade. The warm naturals are perfect when mixed with a warm tonal shade and the intense naturals are in between the two in terms of tonality, neither warm nor cool and can be mixed with any shade. Huverse Demi Permanent Gloss is perfect for blending hair that is up to 50% white. The benefit of blending is that the client has a softer grow out. This is due to the Demi Permanent Gloss not lifting or adjusting the natural pigment in the hair. This means when it fades, there is no unwanted warm tones. Using the naturals in the Demi Permanent Gloss portfolio will help you to achieve the greatest white hair blend. When blending, the same one-to-one -one mixing ratio applies and you should always process at room temperature for the full 20 minutes. Nina's hair only requires a small amount of white hair blending and the Demi Permanent Gloss is perfect for this. My formula was 6.03, 6.81 and 6.5 bowl cream developer. I blended this with a mid-length and ends colour which was 9.81 with 6.5 bowl liquid developer. All Huverse Permanent Tonal Shades will provide at least 50% white hair coverage without the addition of natural shade. When your client is wanting a contemporary coverage and their hair is over 50% white, the addition of a natural shade will help you to achieve the desired coverage. For this, you can use either 20V or 30V depending on the levels of lift required on the natural hair. The standing mixing ratio of 1 to 1.5 applies with a 35 minute processing time. Huverse Permanent Intense Natural was specifically created with coarse white hair in mind, where dense opaque coverage is required. We formulated with double the micro pigments to help saturate the coarse hair and ensure opacity. When the hair is coarse and over 50% white and you want to use a tonal shade, follow this guide. It will tell you how much Intense Natural your formula requires. When formulating with Intense Naturals, 30 bowl cream developer should be used. It helps to oxidise the extra pigment and also helps to prevent banding. One of the great things about Huverse is even for the most intense coverage, the same mixing ratio and timing applies. One to one and a half, 35 minutes. Lena's hair is 80% coarse white hair. So today I've used the Intense Naturals. My formula was 30 grams of seven plus with 10 grams of 7.44. A one to one and a half mixing ratio with 30 volume cream developer. On the ends I've balanced with our Demi Permanent Gloss. My formula was 8.4 and 7.44. Occasionally you may have a client that has very resistant hair that's challenging to cover. In this instance, consider using a resistant mix. Intense Naturals with 30 volt cream developer at a 1 to 1 mixing ratio. The processing time remains at 35 minutes. I usually start at the front where the hair has the most amount of white and is the hardest to cover. I use very fine sections to ensure full saturation and adhesion to the hair. Once I've finished the entire application, I aerate the hair to ensure even oxidisation. I have one last check to make sure I've completely covered the hairline. When it comes to white hair coverage, our clients have their own preferences and needs. With Huverse, you have the flexibility to meet all of these. 